Echo! Hyperion suggests staying inside. The outdoors. Die with me! Launching the fast travel station now. Nothing gets results like a death threat. They've damaged the weapon again.
always happy to do business with a vault hunter. <laughs> Goodbye, friend. If you drop it in the house, I'll have you killed. I'm very sorry to say, in a fit of extreme paranoia, I hid my notes on the opening of the vault and promptly forgot their locations. While I grind my teeth to dust and frustration, you will retrieve these animals for me. The city may be safe right now, but what happens if I... Oh, good. You're not dead. That's his way of saying... Right. Sorry. Dead if it were for you. We need a plan. Jack's getting closer and closer to digging up the warrior, and we still don't know where he's got the vault key stashed. I can help you with that. You? Damn it, we told you never to contact us again. Will you please just hear me out? Sure, let's listen to the crazy computer that just tried to kill us. Hey, remember that time she told us the vault was full of loot? It's with me. I'm charging the vault key. Continue. The key naturally charges itself once every 200 years. Jack is patient, but he's not that patient. He's been using my power to forcibly charge the key with Iridium. If you find me, you find the Vault Key. The Vault Key is housed in my AI control core atop Thousand Cuts. It's protected by three impassable security hurdles. First is a competitor. Deterrence field that will obliterate any non Hyperion entity passing through it. Competitor deterrence field? What, like a death wall? It is a field of pure thermosonic energy programmed to atomize any unauthorized personnel. So, yeah, a death wall. Beyond that lies the second hurdle. A defense bunker outfitted with the most high-tech weaponry Hyperion can afford. That doesn't sound good. Past the bunker, you'll have to get through the final hurdle. A door that will only open for Handsome Jack. Well, that sounds even worse. This will be your only opportunity to steal the vault key and stop Jack from controlling the warrior. I'm out of time. Do what you will, but promise me this. No matter what happens, do not allow Lilith into my chambers. What the hell's that supposed to mean? If she was luring us into a trap, she would have made it sound a little bit possible. If we're taking that bitch down, I'm coming. Trap or not. If anyone's gonna shut her down, it has to be you, soldier. Head to the Hyperion Preserve. I think I know how to get past the first hurdle. a shindig you know i'd go but i ain't gonna hey man i uh... shorty must die that crop blocker he made one of my catch rides and nobody's gonna dance that lady don't wanna bang it sometimes they when 
and I'm drunk. He's hiding in stalker territory. Go get him. Jack blasted my personal safe out of my own store. My most precious treasure could be in the hands of some freeholding bandits by now. Head back to that city-sized hole in the ground and get my safe back. Oh, sorry, I can't make it. Give Claptrap my love, though. Hello. My purely hey. for... Come on back, buddy. It's time to start the party. Oh, slap him. Several of my limbs the last time we met. One hopes the scent of my extremities will bring him out of hiding. Grab my hand outside Slappy's lair in the Highlands. <laughs> Prizes in Moxie's underdog. A chest full of loot and Moxie herself. I lost the second prize to Jack and the first to a thief named Carson. I don't care if I never see those guns again, but if you want them, just find Carson in the dust. I've set up some pizza and some sparkling wigglers. Just hit that boom button and we'll get this party started. All right, the guests should be arriving. Pizza. So, uh, take some home if you want. That was the best party I've ever thrown! <laughs> 